Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Ostaszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. This video channel is at smarturl.it forward slash pass actuarial exams. Here you have information about online seminars and study manuals for exams PFM, IFM and LTAM that I offer. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax-deductible donation to support our students, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's a problem for today for exam P on probability. For a certain health insurance policy, losses are uniformly distributed on the interval from 0 to 450. The policy has a deductible of D and the expected value of the unreimbursed portion of a loss is 56. Calculate D. And here's a solution. So because we know that losses have this uniform distribution on 0 to 450, the expected value of the losses is uh, the expected value of that uniform distribution, which is the midpoint of the interval, so 225. The expected value of reimbursed losses is given by the Darth Vader rule as the integral from the deductible D to 450, which is the point at which the survival function becomes zero, uh, of the survival function of the random uh, value of the loss, which is simply the fraction of the interval from for 0 to 450 that is to the right of x, which is um, 450 minus x over 450 minus 0 dx. That's the angle from 0 to 450 of 1 minus x over 450 dx. And that's equal to minus 450 over 2 times 1 minus x over 450 squared. And that's the function whose derivative we have under the integral, and this is evaluated from x equal to d to x equal to 450. Of course, when x is equal to 450, this is equal to 0, um, so we only need to subtract the value of this at 0, but minus min minus makes it a plus, so two minuses make it a plus, and this is simply 450 over 2, which is 225, times 1 minus d over 450 squared. Okay, and we know the difference of the two to be 56, so that 225 minus 225 times 1 minus d over 450 squared is equal to 56. And this is the, um, this is a simple equation with d being the unknown, and we solve it for d, and we get d to be equal to 450 times 1 minus the square root of 225 minus 56 over 225. That's equal to 450 times uh, 1 minus 13 over 15. And that's 450 times 2 over 15. And that's equal to 60, which is answer A. Please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem itself belongs to a society of actuaries. The solution is mine. Good luck in your studies and good luck on the test. 